And hello, hello everyone. Welcome back. Bogmod here. You know, I'd like to expand more. I really would. Clean rate up 50. Uh, which, yeah, which puts it at 325, 480. Which is not technically quite enough to reach. Without finding just the right person. There it is. See? Colonial range. That is the person who would do it. With those two, when I get the next Diplotech, then I could reach it. From there, all of this is easily reached and easily colonized. Oh no! England. I hate you, England. I hate you. Well, it's fine. It's fine. It's all good. Just gonna build up her income. Not start a war. Because I need those tech points. That sweet, juicy technology. Oh, but I'm so many years ahead. Is it worth it? Would it be worth it? My heart says no, but my spleen says yes. Rush the new world. Well, didn't rush. I should have taken... The stability. I'll take the tax and come hit. Uh, once again, oh, Curtis said, you know, if you weren't all horrible mountains, you might be worth investing in, Curtis Dan. There we go. I'll just throw a few points around. This uses up a hundred. The next, um, oh, Castile. Right. The next, it occurs to me, the next institution will be spawning soon. Colonialism. Two years. Let's see. Uh, Professor has quest for the New World. I do. On the New World continent. I don't have any. Mm, I don't have any. I don't have that. 1500 is an estate. So I don't think I'll be getting colonialism to spawn. It'll probably spawn in... Like it has to spawn in one of the countries that, that's been reaching overseas, so Castile. Oh, maybe not. Portugal or England at the moment. All right, well, let's make the friendly with them. It is a dangerous wonder how a heathen such as yourself acquired this rich and prosperous land. Luckily, it will soon be rectified. Oh, so mean. Can I send them an insult? There we are. So a scornful insult costs five. Doubles the number England enemies. So make Castile and France like me more. It'll gain ten power production. I will confirm. Bam! If Henry VIII fell into the Thames, it would be misfortune. 
If someone dragged him out again, that would be a calamity. Oh! Burn. Burn on him. Oh, yeah. Cut house! Yay. The problem with the heredity local nobility, they tend to value their local interests over those of the rest of the nation. We need to steadily expand the reach of the government, which begins with the most important area of administration, justice. So, Pasha. Bills would be cheaper. Regiments built there would be more expensive. But the state would be interesting. It seems almost worthwhile. It's dead because the Constantinople is just such an amazing place. A little courthouse here. Because why wouldn't I? That armies are training. How is my military doing? Ooh, it's not bad. Forty-four percent. Solid. buy the colonial dude now. It's expensive, yes. Yes. Ooh. But already, we start to see the dividends as we can reach the American East Coast. But can I colonize? Nope. 468. But see, we're only 49 points. Oh, Genoa and Pharaoh at war because of an excommunication. All right. Which means all I need, all I need, two years, two simple years, and we can we can hit that part of Africa, and once that's done, we can bounce to the Caribbean, and Mexico, and all of this becomes our playground. And once again, I have many points of development to, to, to dispatch out. Uh... Nope. Nope. Uh, there we are. There are a couple hundred points. Just means my military has to get stronger, I suppose. A tragic fate. They don't like me. How's Muscovy doing these days? What are you up to? You're a little backwards. The breath of colonialism. Wait a minute. Athena? Did, did I get colonialism? I think... I did! Well, suck at other countries. Ha! Ha ha! I didn't expect that. I really didn't think I could. But I did, and I did. So, the discovery of the new world has heralded a new era, not only for colonizers and the colonized. It's a spread of materials and techniques, as well as a realization of the vast size of the globe. Animals, crop types, silver, and diseases. You know, one of these things is not like the others. So across the Atlantic, the first steps have been taken towards a truly global economy. As foreign lands and people are mapped and documented, the ideas as well as the religious and philosophical debate has become more and more colored than we have found in overseas societies. Great minds felt the need to question what was once truth from Valladolid to Fatpur Sikri and the nature of the world is not for debate. Well, lots of points. Uh, great. Government reform. Great. Prestige. Great. Bam! 
That's a good start! And as you can see, that means it's starting to spread to me. To me. Which means if I do decide to spend any more points, I want to spend them over here in places where it'll enhance the colonialism. Yay! Passive stability. Ooh, could I? I think the edicts, institutions spread the advancement effort. Bam! Eighty-three. Uh, I would like fifty admin. Thank you. But look, look, everyone. One month. There. Yeah, I'm ahead of time. Taking it anyways. Uh, that one I'm going to save, because I can use those points to help fund uh, the expansion of colonialism. But, more importantly, more, more importantly, Sierra Lee. <coughs> mm, excuse me. <coughs> mm. Sierra Leone will get a colonist dispatched from Constantinople itself. I guess they sail from Corfu, um, but still, I think it's a it's a good thing. What ideas did you take? Religious and offensive ideas. Oh, not bad. Tradition of Theodoro. Trade power. Army tradition decay. Cheaper, uh, cheaper mercenaries. Gorgios of Gothia. Alright. I'm kind of okay with all that. Speaking of being things I'm okay with. The admission of clergy. Free admin policy. Cheaper advisors, and the merchant guilds like me more. Civil War and Champa. Or cheaper leaders. I'm going to lean towards the administrative clergy, because a free admin idea is useful. Ah, oh, that's a great, great, amazing feeling. Though I now have to spend some of those points I was talking about. There we go. Uh, force the merchants to lower their prices. They become less loyal. Lose some cash, but they become more loyal. Sure. Ooh, the great naval reform. Slim the first, called the Grim. It's a aesthetic man with a sharp mind. Seeing the threat of the great Christian navies, especially the Venetian one. <laughs> Uh, the Ottoman Empire had to greatly expand its navy. And the mission of the Arsenal in Venice, he ordered the construction of the Imperial Halix Shipyard. You know, I saw the Arsenal, but only from a distance when I was in Venice. I saw it while on a boat, appropriately enough. To the end of the game, 5% cheaper boats, but it's expensive. You know what? Let's debase that economy twice. And build that shipyard. Mm. There we are, we got... We have a colony, everybody. Yes, indeed. Oh, perfect. Native assimilation. That was helpful. Yeah. 
guys. Yes. Fifty-no-three. Plus 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 forty-five. Hmm. So I don't think I need it here. So no edict. Instead, it'd be far better served up here, or maybe over here. Yes, that'll help out better. And I suppose the capital. All right, there we are. Making money again. Um, I guess I could conquer Ragusa now. Do I wanna? You know what, I think I do. The time has come for such things. What are you up to, buddy? You're exploring the coasts, eh? Well, all right. Well, the coast, American coast, Caribbean. Right, head, head to that east coast. Oh, Cyprus, at one point I will likely conquer you, but not today. Again, I hear Cyprus is a lovely place, but these mountains are just so dour-looking. Slap my votes right there to completely dominate... Matua, Wurmberg, and Cyprus. Well, I don't really care. I'm going to aim for niche. So looking at the numbers, I have the advantage. By thousands upon thousands of troops. And I've already killed their leader. Or not their leader, but one of their armies. Mm. Good advisor died. Well, good. it was okay. It wasn't. It wasn't the one I really need. Mm. Oh, look! That one's already breaking. Their capital is falling. Their ships are sinking. Their ships are sunk. Uh, go there. Why not? Why not? Ooh, the political crisis. Uh, ten legitimacy? Ten legitimacy. Our Padishah is quite talented at these things.
take the lands that I have claims on. And that's it. Not so bad. Add some cash on there, because, duh. And maybe go after Cyprus. Golden Air for the Mamluks. 10%. Oh, that might make them a little bit of a tougher fight. It might. upgrade you. It's duh. Why wouldn't you? Our ships upgrade here. Uh, let's siege there, I guess. But actually, let's send you there. Because I have an idea. A wonderful idea. Merge them. Upgrade them. Protect the trade of Alexandria. Back to the Caribbean with you. Coalition's right form. Uh, uh, nothing serious. Nothing. Ooh. Uh, it's, not, it's a thing. Oh! Just because I can, I probably should remember to activate my free taxes. Hmm. Cyprus, Cyprus. What's this? Bolo and the Royal Princes. Find an excuse. Uh, Excel immediately. Yeah, I don't want to lose. I don't like to lose my base production points. So where you go? Oh yeah, way ahead on that. Um, this cost me that. So grab my free colonies. Boop. You can expel expel minorities. Not that I've ever done that. Not that I think I'm likely to ever, but it's an option. We have the ability to absorb more minorities now, after all. Alright. I'm gonna... Let's see if I can land some troops here. I mean, 18,000. I, I said they always leave the general for last. That needs to be fixed, I think. But... Looks like the number game... And the actual cannons. Yep. Now that's the end of that. Cockatrice's own traps on. Okay. Yeah, I've got a permanent claim. Oh. Oh. Uh, we want, of course, move toward mysticism. These are hard times. Mantua got an army over there. Not quite sure how they did, but they did.
Whee! Off you go, boys. Not a lot of expansion yet. Portugal definitely has made, kind of made their claim on Brazil. But the Caribbean, that's kind of still an open, an open option. The admin? Oh, well, thank you. I do like free admin points. Just as well, I have the scythe coming up soon. So, can I take Cyprus as well? I just have Cyprus. Yes, I could. You know what? It's not part of the war goal, but I'm going to do it. Romp. And then I take those. Romp. There we are. I guess we can move back here with you. Guess I have to use my boat for that one. Uh, so, conquer Serbia achieved. If I take it, I get a permanent claim on Bosnia and the Wallachia region. Which I'm inclined to take. So, at the gates of Europe for 10 years. Manpower and prestige for the next decade. We've got some lands we can go for. Genoa to the coalition. Meh. But yes. Ever since the Hungarian king, Sigmund, led a force of Frankish creators against the Ottoman forces, we have not been secure. Although Allah grants us victory that day, we must push further the Balkans to ensure that our lands are protected in the future. Hold on a second. Is that what I think it is? Oh. I thought that was all Genoa. But no, Castile has muscled on in. Into here. How is the spread coming for my lands? Ooh. It is going very good. Good enough, I don't think I need to be uh, spreading it quite the same way anymore. Percent forty eight four thirty one seventy seven seventy eight fifty good, very good. I am made pleased by this. Oh, they haven't even accepted Renaissance yet. I'm filled with shame. some parts of the world. Just very backwards. Very, very backwards. Alright, well we're taking a break here. We will um, hopefully finish off our colony next next episode. And from there, from there, oh, the new world opens up to us. So thank you all for watching. I'll see you soon for more. Bye.